hello everyone it's princess and welcome back to my channel so today we are going to be filming a post-operative haul so as you know i'm getting weight loss surgery in two days because i don't know when the video is going to come out but today's the 13th i'm getting my weight loss surgery on the 15th if everything goes well of course so basically there's certain things you have to do and have to eat basically for the rest of your life so basically i went out and purchased a whole bunch of stuff that's going to help me and yeah so First thing I'm going to start off with is, uh, hold on, I only have to see my address. Okay, so this um, certain medication that you have to take for the rest of your life. So one thing that I bought is Colace, and Colace is a stool softener, and because obviously you're not eating, I'm not going to be eating real food until January 1st, so therefore you get a little constipated, so that's one thing. And this is Gas X, and basically... They pump you with air for the surgery, so you're going to have, like, gas pains in your shoulder, and you're just going to be really gassy, so that's supposed to help relieve your gas. Now, I got these. You're supposed to get chewable Flintstone ones. I think I actually got the wrong ones. They said they get the ones that complete, but the, but it's then on the paper, it says with iron. This is the only one that says with iron, but it'll work either way. Okay. So, I got a lot of these in here. I'm only just going to show you, obviously, one of each. So... You have to start taking a B complex. And then once a week, you're supposed to take a B12 and it goes under your tongue. So those are the vitamins that I um, basically have to take the rest of my life. One thing is basically from the 15th until eight weeks after my surgery, I cannot take regular calcium. They want me to take Tums. And the thing is, is like I ordered Tums on December 1st. They have yet to come from Amazon. So and it's a specific type of tum. It's like the ultra strength. It has to have like 1,200 milligrams. It's not here yet. So if it was here, I would show you. But just imagine a bottle of Tums that have 1,200 milligrams. That's what I'm supposed to take until after eight weeks. And then I can go back to taking um, my regular calcium, which is just a tablet. So another thing, basically, from the 15th to the 18th, I'm going to be doing just a regular clear liquid diet. So it's going to be water, broth tea coffee decaf of course and then basically like popsicles and sugar-free jello that's going to be from those three days but afterwards i'm going into what's called a full liquid diet which is basically going to be the same thing kind of thing i'm doing now this is just like the higher protein protein shakes and then um like pudding and stuff like that but for now i went out and bought a whole bunch of higher protein ones so i'm gonna show you it's gonna be pretty heavy to pick up but i'm gonna show you the first one Ugh. so let me make sure my name is not on it nowhere okay it's on the top so oh god these are um pretty good like gnc protein shakes the protein shakes have to have 25 through 30 grams of obviously more if you can but that's what this is so these are chocolate um and they have 26 grams of protein that's good so that's one of them i got a lot because at the end of the day, even when I do go back to eating real foods, I can um, have these for a way to get protein. I'm just going to show y'all one of these because it was already open. So that is that. Basically, I have, to have a certain amount. So this has 25 grams of protein, 170 calories, and no sugar. These are, these are vegan, actually, for people that are vegan. Okay, so the next thing I got is called ensure max protein shake that's 30 grams of protein so so here we go here what it looks like ensure max protein and it has 30 grams of protein it has one gram of sugar but they say you shouldn't have anything more than nine grams so i'm good with that um 120 calories and it's cafe mocha hopefully it's good okay um this video is going to be all over the place, and I apologize. The next thing I have is, I don't feel good, it's pure protein. So, I basically, here's what they look like. I got pure protein, they have 30 grams, so I base, I got chocolate, vanilla, and strawberry. So, there are three packs of four, so I'm trying to get a little variety. They have 140 calories and one gram of sugar, so that's that one. Um, the next thing I got is 
Core Power High Protein Milkshake. 26 grams. This is actually the one that they recommended. It says strawberry banana. I just want to try something different. It's probably not going to be good. It is 170 calories. And how many grams of sugar? Six grams. That's a lot of grams of sugar. But they recommended it, so I don't know. And then, basically, last but not least, with the protein drinks or Premier Protein. Of course, this one's not open. Ugh. Oh, God, y'all. I, I have, like, no energy right now, but I wanted to film this video for people. So, this is Premier Protein, 30 grams of protein. 160 calories, I think one gram of sugar. I can't see that small. But this is the chocolate kind. I'm not really fond of it because I didn't know I wasn't fond of it until I tried it like the other day. But because first of all, it has like a very artificial artificial chocolate flavor. I'm gonna put this up here because it's not heavy. But that is that. Mmm. Okay. Also, this is what I got for my uh I gotta make sure my address is not the only thing. This is what I actually got for like turning a liquid diet, a clear liquid diet. I got these sugar free um, crystal light lemonades. I did not know that it was gonna come with this many. I'm gonna be having these for a long time. Hopefully, they don't expire anytime soon. So, I'm gonna put that down there. So, here we go. Basically, I start my parade food diet on January 1st. So, I got me an electric food processor. It's I, This one's actually for babies. And they're like, why'd you get one for baby? Well, because um, I feel like it would have to grind the food up really good for babies. So, and I hate, is this, can I open this or no? I kind of want to show y'all everything, but I feel like I'm not going to be able to open it. Um, I'm not going to open it, but basically it heats the food up for you. It also um, comes with little, like, maybe two-ounce things, which is actually good for when you first start eating regular food. Two ounces is, I think, the amount you're supposed to have. So, speaking of that, I got a food scale because I need to weigh my food. So, boom. Um, and majority of this stuff came from Amazon. Like, majority of this stuff. Except for the vitamins. The vitamins actually came from a vitamin store. But majority of this stuff came from Amazon. Um, I do not have the prices. I apologize. But you can always just look them up. This is by Nice. Well, literally all I did was look up a food scale, and I tried to get the one that had good reviews. So yeah, um, it takes two AAA batteries, and that's basically what it looks like. I don't know if I'm open this yet. I don't know. Okay. So another thing is I, I didn't mention, but when I start taking my vitamins, I have to take them basically three times a day because you're not supposed to take your multi multivitamin and your calcium at the same time which i never knew that nobody ever told me that so i got this pill case y'all know i like my pill cases so morning noon and night so that's how i'm gonna be taking my pills and it's a rainbow which is so cute and it has a different day so i love this one um i'm trying to do stuff like kind of in the order but it really doesn't matter. So what I did, what someone actually recommended was to get baby bowls and baby stuff. Because you're basically going to be eating like a baby. You can't eat that much and you should have a smaller spoon so you take smaller bites. So this is a set of baby bowls and um, spoons. So that's the first one. Then I got a little pack of these little baby um, cups. Because you're not supposed to drink much. And obviously your, body, your, your stomach is not going to allow you to drink much. So, and they're all by Munchkin, and they're all from Amazon. So, I think the colors are cute. And then, I've got little utensils. So, that one just came with spoons. So, I got some forks. And, basically, just more spoons. It's funny how they're all the same brand. And I really didn't plan that, by the way. But, so we have little baby plates. I'm just going to show you all this. I'm just going to show you all the back, because it kind of shows all the actual size of them. But it came with a two-pack of these. And then that's that. So that's basically more so when I start eating real food. And then another thing somebody recommended, she said after she had surgery, it was hard for her to get in her protein and her water. So she bought these right here. You basically can put your protein shakes and your water in here. And then it's like a little popsicle. So it's like it's easier to go down and it's like more soothing. So it's called Create Your Own Custom Healthy Popsicle Yogurt Smoothies and much more. So, 
It comes with a funnel, actually. So yeah, you just you just put it in there, just put it in the freezer, boom. Um, anything else before I show you all the last thing? Nope. Okay. Um, actually, another thing I'm missing is like these little plastic like shot glasses, but I think they're actually smaller. They're supposed to be one ounce cups, and the thing is that's because when you get done, when you get done, it's apparently you're not going to be able to drink as much. So if you have like one ounce of water, it's going to be easier to combine to chew, digest, than just having like a whole bottle of water. So that's why I bought them. They have yet to come either. Come on, Amazon. But here is the last thing I'm really, really happy about this. It is a Fresh Star Bariatric Cookbook. It had on oh, my fingerprints. It's actually not my fingerprints. I don't know what that is. But it has had very, very good reviews. And, um... Amazon is by Sarah Kent. So it says healthy recipes to enjoy favorite foods after weight loss surgery. So I only looked at like one page, but like you open it, it says turkey breakfast burritos. That sounds so good right now. I have not eaten in a minute, obviously, but basically it has like tips. It has like the starting process all the way up to the end. And that's what I really like about this. I can't wait to read this and stuff like that. So basically that is everything in this haul. It just is like most of like said stuff for after my surgery. I never actually did a haul of um stuff like for the liquid diet before, but I kind of talked about it in a video. So and another thing I got just for funsies and it's kind of cute. His name is Barry the Sleeve. He's like he's a gastric sleeve stomach. So like that's the sleeve part right there. And this is the part that they take off. I think it's so cute. But yeah, so this is everything that I have for my surgery. I'm only missing my Tums and then like my uh, little glasses so I can drink. And basically that is it. Obviously I have a whole Amazon list of things that I'm going to get when I need to get them. Like right now I don't need much because it's like, I don't know. And like the food processor I don't need until January 1st. I don't need to wash the bowls and stuff until like the 31st of December. And like these, I may like open these up and see what to do with them. I think it'd be kind of cool. But I think there's 125 of them in there actually. And then like the scale, I'll probably open up maybe next week. I don't really need it now. But yeah. And then actually one thing I did want to do is start to fill up my medication. Because I'm going to be really sleepy. So, But we will see. But thank you guys so much for watching. On This is like, we lost 29 maybe? 8, 9? Um, we are really close, and I am happy and prepared. I am really prepared. So this video will be coming out soon. Then another video will be coming out with basically me showing you all the stuff that's in my hospital bag. But please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Please watch all the videos in this playlist because basically your weight loss journey may not be the same as mine. But I want to help everybody, and I don't feel the best, but I'm still doing this, so... See you guys later. Bye-bye.